Well, we rejected independence in the referendum. And Scotland's budget was cut by four billion after Westminster scrapped the Barnet formula. Now we can't afford bus passes for the elderly. The sick have to pay for their prescriptions. And the Scottish NHS is now privatised. The bedroom tax hasn't been scrapped. It's still with us. The council tax freeze is long gone. Welfare benefits have been cut and many can't afford to buy food. University tuition fees are back. But billions are found to pay for nuclear weapons. Why, I miss my wee pal Pip. He was deported after the EU referendum. Scotland voted to stay in, but down south, they wanted it. Westminster took away Scotland's powers over planning and our renewables energy industry suffered. We got nuclear power plants instead and had to store mere nuclear waste. Why, oh, the poor, the young, the old and the sick have not fared too well. And plenty in between. But some people did okay out of a no vote. <laughs> oh, oh, I've just had the scariest dream ever. Life in Scotland after a no vote. Oh, it was horrible. It was horrible, so it was. Oh, I think I need to go out for a wee walk. <laughs> hey, you know what? The people of Scotland can make sure this nightmare never happens. All we need to do is to make the right choice on September the 18th. Aye. <laughs> <laughs>